like, I was like, what did I do in Calgary for the first three years? We're here live at Tim Hortons. Evan has got us fully stocked. Drifter Mobile is uh, fueled up and ready. And we are heading to British Columbia on a journey chasing some hot springs. Many a tale has been told about the Crow's Nest Pass. An area from Alberta to BC. You best beware of the stormy weather in the Crow's Nest Pass. <laughs> Here live from the Drifter Mobile. We've pulled over at a boat launch on some beautiful river. Kind of a lucky score somewhere between Bernie and the hot springs we're going to. A uh, long night of driving, and uh, we're just going to chill out here and peel in the morning. Hopefully nobody bothers us. Nice and cozy back there, Ev? I'm doing great, guys. Yeah, it looks awesome. The heater cranked. We'll have to shut it off before we go to bed, just in case. Or it might not wake up. Crossing the river. She's a bit shady out this morning. This is so Here live on the Drifter Network, uh, Loose Here Springs. Water is about 102 degrees Fahrenheit. Very sulfury. Lots of cool people down here. Uh, good spot to check out. <laughs> Working our way back from the hot springs. We got some kind of uh, chewing gum art on a stump. Is it littering or is that cool? I think it's pretty sweet. Greasy. Wonder if there's any flavor left. Hmm. Here live in the Hot Springs parking lot. Uh, we got some drifter eggs and beans, a little bit of bacon, and Evan forgot his coffee cup. Uh, so we've rinsed out this can of beans and uh, might have a little extra flavor. <laughs> there you go, Kev. Thanks, Mauer. <laughs> no worries, Buzz. How was it? <laughs> Cheers, boys. Cheers. We're here live at Tilly Memorial Park in Canal Flats. Just past the hot springs heading towards Radium. Oh, nice little spot. Little beach, boat launch. Yeah, not a bad little... Ready. Drifter Evan navigating the steep, steep hills. Whoa, he's out of control. She's pretty steep. Woo. I'm gonna try a different line. Right. Hey folks, we're here on the Drifter Network. Uh, we got Alberta over here, BC over here, and uh, about 50-50 here. We'll keep it nice and equal here, guys. <laughs> so continental divide, all the water on this side flows to the Pacific, and uh, this side over to the Atlantic. Shout out to the East Coast. Uh, pretty cool spot. Uh, a lot of geological, geographical uh, importance, I guess. Kind of cool. Whew. <laughs> see why in a way his mother was so traumatized by that cholera epidemic because it was a surprising anecdote in the book suggesting that when she was young Charlotte Stoker may have murdered someone. What, what, what do we know? live at uh, Cedar Lakes in Golden BC, me and Kev, and uh, we made the mistake of uh, trusting technology even and the, the directions online said you should probably get a map. We lost. We were a bit lost, so 
we resorted to retracing steps because that's the only thing we can do. So lots of daylight, we're having a good time, but uh, at the end of the day, we lost. <laughs> <laughs> And we're back here at uh, one of the cedar lakes that we recognize. There was four of them and uh, we were trying to do them all and I think we kind of did but uh, things weren't making sense so back on the trail, no harm, no foul. Next time we'll probably get a map or a compass or do something to be a little more prepared than relying on some blogger online. Never trust a blogger unless it's the Drifter Network. See you later folks. Rain rolling, rolling through Golden, all in heavy. Here at the uh, Dreamcatcher Hostel in Golden. Uh, we decided not to stay in the camper tonight. It's pretty cheap. Uh, hoping to meet some new people and take a hot shower after our uh, getting lost in the woods episode. So, we're gonna treat ourselves here. from Emerald Lake. Uh, we are heading to Takawaka Falls. Takaka. Takaka something. It's about 12k or so and the regular way is closed so we're coming via Emerald Lake. Stay tuned for the adventure. Oh, there's Emer Emerald uh, Lake here folks. We've worked our way from there all the way up here and we're on to some goat trails and some rock and ice and fog so uh yeah bring it we're up on the side of a mountain here trying to find the second biggest waterfall in canada canada sorry and uh we're just stopping for some water and some peaches but uh i'm gonna throw these tomatoes into kyle's mouth Bring it on, bud. <laughs> All right, here's the first one. Oh! oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> two for two. Oh, there are two. Yeah, yeah. Oh! oh. <laughs> <laughs> down from Emerald Lake to Yoho Lake. Uh, we got another 4.1 kilometers if we can find the trail and we'll be back on sending it to the waterfalls. Literally bird seed. Oh, oh. Hey. Oh. Come on you little turds. Oh, there we go. Drifter birds are so jealous, eh? <laughs> Oh my gosh, oh, yeah. this is amazing. Wow, hey, you come over here. We're past Yoho Lake here. Water supplies are dwindling, but uh, you can't trust this nice, clean Rocky Mountain spring, then I don't know what you can trust there, folks. Hopefully we don't get beaver fever. <laughs> well, there's our first look at the falls. Long ways away still, but uh, we're still trekking her. Lots of snow, lots of kilometers, lots of nice views. We're here at uh, Takaka Falls. Uh, it's not quite booming. It's really tall, but it's, it's, it's not as high pressured as we were hoping for. Uh, yeah, a long ways in too. We still got to go back, but uh, successful hike so far, Drifter Evan. About 14 kilometers back. It's already 3 p.m. We might be getting back. After dark. Ooh. 
Well, on the way back down, we see the lake. That's a good sign. I think we'll make it, Evan. Probably seven kilometers left. Yeah, 7K, something like that. We'll get her. How's it going, Evan? Hey! <laughs> <fuck>. <laughs> Whoops! Never seen one of these before. Beautiful bird. Well, after all that uh, hiking, my window gave out and it just keeps dropping all the way down. So uh, we're gonna have to uh, improvise here. Get some of Evan's superior roadside skills here. Duct tape, best tool in the toolbox. Crazy day on the mountain indeed. Solid 30 Ks logged. A lot further than we intended on going. Twice as far. Twice as far. But uh, the lake is looking great. And uh, seems like a lot of the tourists have gone home and it's back to the way it was. Chill.